So I've been investing in this stock right now. It's uh, been in the negative and in the positive. It's kind of jumped around uh, over the last, let's say, minute, maybe even 30 seconds, uh, both in the negative and the positive. And you can clearly see there's this motion uh, upwards. Now, who really knows how long that's going to last? But I wanted to make a video on how to perform a sell limit order and what sell limit orders actually do for the beginners here. All right. So first off, let me turn up my mic here so I can hear my own voice. Um, but essentially, let's just say my goal was to uh, sell in the profit. Well, first thing I have to figure out is what is my average cost? And it actually says it right here. So right now, my average cost is seventy-one dollars and seventy-eight cents through a total of 505 stocks or 505 shares excuse me and so 505 shares my average cost 71.78 now that did differ you know i had a little buy and sell period you know so it kind of mixes up how much i paid and, and things like that but that's essentially the average price okay now you can see it's kind of dipping down a little bit it's not a problem it will you know naturally go back up but i can set a limit order to sell, right? Sell a, a limit order to sell. And I can essentially walk away. I don't have to stare at the screen and wait for it to hit a certain number. Okay. So how would that look like? Well, first thing we can do is we can kind of think of, all right, well, seven, and let's kind of do this together. 71.78, right? Is my average cost multiplied by the 505 shares really comes down to 36,248. Okay, so let's just say I wanted to make a hundred dollars, so it'd be thirty six thousand three hundred and forty eight. Let's just say that was the case, thirty six thousand three hundred and forty eight, and we divide this by five hundred and five because we want to know how much value is it per share, right? The value would come out to be seventy one dollars and ninety seven cents a share. So what I could do if I really wanted to make a hundred dollars and that was my complete goal, I would say okay. I want to make $71.97, uh, I want to sell at $71.97 a share, what I would do is I would type in 505 shares here, and then I would type in 71.97, just like that, okay, and then I would hit review order, and then I would hit sell, all right, and what I would do is essentially walk away from the computer screen, walk away from the phone, walk away from everything, and know that this sell is placed. And it will take a matter of time. It could take a day, it could take a week, it could take however long, but eventually it will sell at this number. Okay. Now, obviously, it just depends on where this current stock is. And you can see here I canceled that sale because I actually probably prefer to wait a little bit longer than that, but um, or generate a little bit more. And the reason why is because look at this wide, you know, hills and valleys on these numbers. These numbers can go a lot higher. But the point is, is that this is a video to teach you how to perform a sell limit order properly. Um, you place a certain number, place those number of shares, and you can select when that offer expires, right? So here we have the trading hours. We have all kinds of hours. We have a 24-hour market, which I personally prefer to, to use all the time. Um, and we have an expiration. We have an expiration of 90 days or we have an expiration for the current day. If you want to sell it earlier, just have an expiration earlier. If you want to have a sell it later throughout the 90 days, you know, select this one. But the, the reason why people select one over the other is just purely depends on their willingness. How are, how much are they really willing, um, to wait, right? For that certain sale. Cause if the price doesn't reach, if the if the stock price doesn't reach, it's not going to sell. It's nothing's going to happen. But this was a little tutorial, I guess you could say, um, to show you how to perform that limit sell order on Robinhood. All right. Hopefully you enjoyed. Thanks for watching.